Hello everyone, finally I'm moving to Galicia next Tuesday, so I'm still in Barcelona and I'll be able to film one more video. And I think it's gonna be other stories and H&M, maybe H&M, maybe Urban Outfitters, let's see. I think I never filmed the other stories, it's not really my store, the style is a little bit too feminine, but I didn't visit it for a while, I don't know, maybe for several years, so maybe there's something interesting and I don't know about that. As you may remember, it's not possible to film in the H&M group stores, so I'm going to film only in the fitting room. It was kind of hard, but finally I took some items, most of them they're from Studio Collection. Because the others they're just, they just lack of quality, the materials are not good and the volume is not enough. But still, you can always find something like to take bigger size or whatever, but it's hard in the h down. I think it's either on the website. <laughs> this is the first dress from Studio, okay, like this. I think it's better to take the other size if you want to wear it without anything, just take your size because if not, everyone is gonna see it. Let me see. Or you need to wear something like that or a t-shirt underneath. I can't tell that the material is the one that I like. I think it's tensel or something like that. And uh, it has this movement, this interesting why do you need this? Maybe they're trousers? I don't know. Oh, it's horrible. <laughs> no, it's not. Maybe I can ask the guy there what's that about. So I know I wouldn't buy this dress, but at least it's not boring. It's not something that you can find in the H&M normally. The material is too stretchy, definitely. Wow, didn't expect this from H&M. It's the size XL or L, I don't know. But uh, even for XL, it's very big. I think it's because it's studio, so they just made it very big. But for me, it's fine. I mean, to wear something like that, it's very comfortable. And I think it looks, it looks good. I would buy the blazer. The problem is that the trousers, the smallest size that they had was 42, which is very big. So for the trousers, I definitely would buy something smaller. The trousers are very nice. I like the material and also the feet. Everything is fine except uh, the size of the feet. They just basically don't have it in the store, so I can't try it on. In general, the feet is very nice. They have also the pockets here and these details. They look really good. I mean, you can forget about the size. I think it's the best among everything that I took. Let's see. You even can take like a normal size of your blazer, I think. But for me, I, I love this one. This blazer is based on the Frankie Shaw Bayer blazer because the material is very similar and the fit is also very similar. The only difference is like it's double breasted blazer. Oh, 
Oops, I returned back the address and I didn't check the article number. I hope I'll be able to find it on the website. Oh, it's even pure wool. It's very thin, but... I highly recommend this blazer if you want something like that. But, I mean, the price is also quite expensive. It's not h and price. Okay, so yeah, you have to think about it. Because you can buy something like secondhand for this price from Acne Studios, for example. This is the second look, a little bit bulky, because I'm wearing thermal leggings. The jeans are interesting, very 70s style. And also this is quite 70s. But it could be nicer that this is like longer, more details, you know? This is what H&M lacks. In this case, I would wear something long, for example, a long train. There was one strange on the mannequin, but I couldn't find it in the store. So everything was like short and small except of the studio suit or the dress. These jeans are also from studio. For example, with my bomber from Zara, they look better. It adds a little bit of volume on the top. And running the jeans, actually the quality is very good and they are soft, but the price, I mean, it's a price. It's very expensive. For this thing that was also from studio, I'm even afraid to check it. Let's see, 39. Definitely too much. You can see that the quality is much better compared right? to normal each and down. Everything is made almost perfect, but the price is... <laughs> These two items from studio I also really like. For example, this polo, the material is, is good. The quality is also good to like the others. And this color is very interesting because like it's longer and it has interesting shape. It also has structure at the top. And look at this skirt, it's giant. The problem is that it's L and I definitely need smaller size in this case because you can't even wear a belt. With the rubber, the skirt just goes down. But anyways, I love that it's so long. It just can fall down. So I'm gonna so like that. And look at this body. Wow. The material is interesting. I don't know what is that. It looks like silky. Later I can check it. It's very flattering. I like it. The fits of studio, except the dress, which is weird, they are quite good. They fit much better than the other items. And also the materials and the qualities, I told you. But the prices, you could see them. It's like a middle range brand. It's not like H&M prices. They're like more cost prices. Also, this skirt is so comfortable. I want it. Love it. And it looks good with sneakers. I'm not very sure that I'm gonna go to the other stories because I feel tired and I want to eat. And it's like more than 2 p.m. So I don't know, I didn't decide it 100%, but I don't want to go. Well, it's... 
And it's polyamide. It doesn't feel like polyamide to me. It's a very good quality polyamide. That's why it costs 80 euros. Finally, I decided to enter because first I never entered there. The second it was like in front of H&M, so I need to do it. Wow, I didn't know that other stories have this kind of items. I think I need to try it on. <laughs> it's crazy. I was right and the items, they're like too normal here. So I just took like normal items. I'm gonna mix them together like totally in a crazy manner. And also I took this dress, which is like just crazy without any mixing. This dress fits quite well, the set of them. Generally, if you want a simple dress, it's a good option. I took this sweater and it's size M. It's almost fine, the size. And I think that if you find L, it's a nice option. And this is the girl. It's on sale and it's like really cheap, I think. I can't see anything. Ah, 20 euros, yeah. It's interesting. I'm gonna... Put on the sneakers. Like even like this, it's fine. I also took other stuff, but even like with this dress and the sweater and the cap, it's appropriate. It's not that boring. You just can't imagine it's like too hot in this sweater. You live in the northern country, it's definitely must have and I think it's on discounts. It's very thick. I don't know if it has wool. Yes, it has wool, but I mean, whatever, like it's very, very hot. If you don't live in the northern country, don't buy this sweater. But it's very, very good, very comfortable. I like the mix of colors and also the shape. It's nice and it has long sleeves. I also took the sunglasses. I think that they are a little bit too bright. <coughs> and now I'm gonna show you the total crazy look, like completely crazy. A couple of items more and it's gonna be done. So here is the crazy look. I'm also wearing this jacket. I think it's a very nice jacket. It has these details, the shoulders, and also this bag. I think it's also very cheap because, yeah, it's 40 euros because it's on sale. And I love the jacket. It's surprising. I think it's size L, but it's very comfortable. And uh, I love the details as a teacher. And uh, the same dress, and the same sweater. The sweater, I just want to take it off. I can also try it on with a cap. I think with the glasses is better. Unfortunately, it seems to be that this jacket doesn't have a discount because I was really thinking to buy it, but without a discount, I don't want. Wow, look at this dress! <laughs> it's just crazy. If you want to look like a person from the fairy tale, it's a perfect option. The only thing that I would say, like, two sizes bigger or something like that, for it to be longer. And I also love the colors. 
and normally I, I don't like at all the flower print but this one it looks like painting so in this case I don't really approve I mean this dress is definitely crazy it's not like a typical normal dress but it has its own vibes You definitely look like a cake, like a wedding cake or something like that. I think if I see it on sale, I'm gonna buy it. Just because you won't be able to find anything like this in the other stores. It's very unique. I also love the material, it's very light, thin, airy. And also it keeps its shape. I like the walls here, look, it has flowers. It's cute too. I think that the resuming is that you can find, like in any place, almost any store, you can find something that you like or something which is interesting. The thing is that you need to search for it and you need to try it on and that's all. So thank you for watching my video and I think that next time we're going to see each other in Lugo and I'm going to film Massimo Dutti because there are not a lot of things. Or I'm going to go to La Coruña and film Sara because Sara there is amazing because it's like the headquarter of Sara.